Welcome to Express Bytes, a series of short videos to help youth transition into the world of work. Hi, I'm Ian from Youth Express, and we have been helping young people transition into education, the community, and the world of work since 1993. In this series of video workshops, we're looking at the job interview. Today, I'm just going to do a little demonstration on how to tie a tie. Some of you may not be so familiar with that. Hopefully this will help you along. So if you're going to an interview and you believe that wearing a tie is good for your image, make sure you select the right shirt first. Button up from top to bottom, preferably long sleeves, not a short sleeve one. Collar up first, do your top button up. You may not have put a tie on with the shirt before and you may not have ever tied, put the top button up. Check it, put your finger inside it. If, it, if you can't get your finger in there, that's gonna to be too tight during the day. Select a tie, I've got a few here to pick from. Conservative corporate look. Not too flashy, just right. I'm gonna set this up, wide side of my right hand, narrow side of my left hand. And remember, once I tie the knot, I'm gonna pull it tight and this short end will stretch further down. I want it to end up around about my belt line. First lap around, one full circuit. Right hand, two fingers at the front, thumb at the back. So I'm holding it there and what the fingers are doing is keeping a gap because I come around for the second lap, up through the middle, down through the gap that I created with my fingers and just pull that through. Tidy up the knot now before you don't yank it up tight now because then you won't be able to straighten it up. Get the ripples out of the way first. Don't over tighten from the big end because it'll make the knot too small or too tight. I want a bit of size there. Hopefully, if I've done a very good job of this, the short piece will end up in the middle with the bottom, and it does. So when this tip is in that little diamond at the bottom, that's excellent. Put your collar down, maybe get someone to help you. Make sure it's all nice and tidy at the back. Tidy at the front, look in the mirror. On the back, we have a little loop here. Put this narrow section through there. That keeps it nice and tidy. Don't tuck it in your shirt like that. It looks like you've been back in primary school, all right? Leave it like that. Remember, as when we dress, what we select changes our image. So depending on what tie you wear, will change the image you're presenting. Hello, welcome back to the 80s. If you're pinching one from dad or granddad's cupboard, be careful not to get this one. You got a fun personality? Maybe this one's for you. Or maybe just a bit colorful and a bit out there. Hopefully this will help you and you can see the difference here. So replay the video, practice tying your tie so you get it right, get the two ends reasonably level and away you go. I hope this has helped you today. If you're following on Facebook, don't forget in the comments, tell us what school you're from if you're no longer at school or you're a parent, tell us what suburb you're from. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.